Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to Apop's channel. My name is Tyla and I am going to be doing a little video on this channel today talking about five things that I learned as an au pair. I spent 10 months in Paris, France as an au pair from September 2019 to July 2020 and I had the absolute time of my life. Apop's channel definitely helped me prepare so much when I was gathering information about going abroad and so I'm so honored to be on this channel and to give you guys some advice and some lessons that I learned during my au pair year. So if this sounds good to you, be sure to keep on watching and if you're interested in more of the videos that I make, there will be a link in the description. My YouTube is Tyla Ali and I will be really happy to see you guys over on my channel over there so with that being said let's just get right on into the video so the first and biggest thing I learned from being an au pair was patience now when you're taking care of kids that's the number one thing you need and I think that it helps me in every scenario after being an au pair is because I just have so much more patience for the little things in life by babysitting kids I have learned so much patience from that and this transcribes into my everyday life even now whether it be a line at the grocery store or any minor inconvenience that happens in my life I just have such a go with the flow attitude about it now that I have had so much experience with dealing with kids it teaches you so much patience and that is something that I'm super super grateful for Another thing that au pairing taught me was that it's really okay to go against the grain of life. It's not just a fast track to success. It's really okay to slow down and live your life. Uh, taking one year to go have experiences abroad that you may not ever have the chance to have in your life is definitely worth just putting yourself out there and doing. And in your host country for a year, not much is going to change. The people that you love will still be there and the experiences that you're meant to have will still be there waiting for you once you return so you don't lose any anything by just going to have this like once in a lifetime experience. It really did teach me to go out and experience things, meet new people, and really just how to slow down and learn how to enjoy life a bit more. The third thing that au pairing taught me was how to be fearless. Like this is seriously such a big thing for me. I even got a tattoo on my wrist that says fearless in French because that was really the overall common theme of my journey abroad was that I had to learn how to be fearless in every situation. There were situations that I had just never been in before in my life. I traveled to Poland by myself and I got super sick on my plane and I missed my train to get to where I had to go. I don't know Polish but I had to figure out how to communicate with somebody in any other language. I was like, do you know French? She was like, no, do you know Dutch? I was like, no, do you know Spanish? Like I could figure out Spanish on a whim if I have to. There are just so many situations that you will be in where you just know it's like fight or flight. Like you got, I had to get to my friend's house in Poland and I needed to get there before it was gonna be dark and I was stranded in the middle of Poland. <laughs> So just knowing that you can and will get through any scenario, it really just brings out that like fearlessness in you. And I think that's something that will transcribe into the rest of your life going into any situation. Now, one of the things that is most dear to my heart that I learned about being an au pair is that it's really possible to make friends anywhere. I've learned how to start a conversation with literally anybody, especially since my native language is English. I live in the United States now. Um, I learned to literally go up to anybody who I heard speaking English and make a friend. Now after the world situation that we are in, when we are able to travel freely, I know that I am able to make friends all over the world and that I have friends all over the world that I can go visit and stay with just because of being so fearless and confident and making friends with people wherever I went. So before I moved to Paris, honestly I didn't know if I wanted to have kids of my own and that is a main reason why I wanted to go and have this experience was because I didn't know if I wanted to start my own family one day and this is an experience that can really open your eyes and teach you if you do want kids or don't. For me, it taught me that I do want kids. I loved being a part of this host family and kids just bring me so much joy and that's something that I know is something that I want in my future. I personally believe that you should have kids because you want to be a parent and um, this definitely taught me that I do want to raise my own kids one day and put beautiful members of society into the world. And this is a really great way to test you and make sure that you feel that you are up for that challenge eventually. <laughs> the last thing that au pairing taught me was how not to have fear around money. Now, I know that especially when you are moving abroad and especially if you don't have that much money saved up, which you always should, um, just saying, have money for like at least a flight home and just backup plan money. But it did teach me to not have um, as much fear around money in general because on an au pair salary, as you may know, you don't make that much. You may average about 80 to 100 a euro a week. So that really is just pocket money. Yes, all of your other supplies like food and housing 
are there for you and are supplied by your host family but anything extra that you want to do such as going on trips or getting meals with friends at restaurants that's going to be coming out of your own pocket so this really taught me that i will always be financially secure no matter what because you really do learn how to live off of like not that much <laughs> you learn how to travel on barely any money and it makes it all the more enjoyable because you know that you don't have much but you're going and having these amazing life experiences and it really does teach you that you don't need to be the richest person out there to have like a really great life i remember when i had first gotten to france i went on a trip to amsterdam and i took a five-year-old flix bus to amsterdam so you really don't need much money to travel once you're already in europe which is something that i really loved about living there is that you can get almost anywhere for not that much money and you can still have the time of your life so you don't have to be rich to live a life full of adventure and living off of 80 to 100 euro a week really does teach you that. So there are so many more things that being an au pair teaches you, but those are just five of the ones that I have today for you guys on this channel. If you are interested in knowing more about my journey abroad, they have more videos over on my channel, um, more about my experience. And I am just so happy to be on this channel today and to share a little bit more of my story and things that I learned. So I hope that this was a benefit to you guys. And if it was, definitely make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. And maybe if you have been an au pair before, comment a thing that you learned from the experience. And I'd be really interested to talk to you guys in the comments down below so thank you so much for watching this video and thank you to apop for having me on this channel and i will see you guys over on my channel if you choose and i hope you enjoy the rest of your day and are remaining safe and happy during this holiday season i'm sending so much light to you guys and i'm signing off here thanks for watching bye